Welcome back! Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to talk so loud there. But welcome back to Mega Man X6. Let's tackle the uh, remaining bosses we've got here. And see how close we can get to ending this game. Hopefully we don't get through these bosses too fast. Gates Lab 2 is something I am dreading because I've heard it's a nightmare. Literal nightmare with platform. We might go through that as Falcon Arm. Alright, let's start with the Weapon Center. That looks like fun. We want to go through S. Let's go through a zero first. And we'll see how things go. Now, just so you know, we might be doing an extra episode of the Final Fantasy VII Remake next week just to make sure I can get through all of it before Rebirth comes out. All right, let's go. Wahoo! I mean, not wahoo because that's how uh, that's how uh, it's he's zero sounded in Mega Man X4. All right, that's Illumina. I thought the project to construct that huge Reploid was suspended. The fiends. All right. What? Oh, that. This guy looks cool. Yeah, we saw him at the end of the last episode. Whoa! Here you go, bud. You've been rescued. Oh my gosh. Who's gonna rescue me? Gotta keep moving. Whoa! Oh, what what happened? Was that part of his power supply? Okay. This is a rather chaotic stage. Whoa! Get out of here. This is fun though, I, I like it. It's very chaotic, but it's cool. Take that! All right, let's not go through the alternate path. Let's just go through the normal path. Unless, you know, I want to really space this out so we don't get to G Gates Laboratory 2 today. No, I don't want to do that. Let's go ahead and go. Oh my gosh, are we already at the boss? Holy crap. I guess that makes sense. Make a really chaotic stage, but make it, uh shorter to make sure that you don't have like make it too long and too difficult that guy looks weird hmm i kind of like his uh portrait there in the cutscene a lot better than his actual uh sprite um weren't you dead to zero you heard wrong are the other investigators useless these. That's the only explanation as to why I have to clean up their mess. But wait, why are you here anyways? What are you doing here? Don't tell me you destroyed my sweet Illumina. What do you think? I haven't even tested her yet. And I was thinking that I'll destroy all the thick-headed so-called authorities with her. Not now! Interesting. All right, so we got like multiple forms. You probably have to attack the original to do any damage to him. Probably have to damage all of them so they don't overwhelm us. Like all this stuff is doing. Wow.
Glad I have this upward slash. Alright, there we go. I probably could have handled that on normal mode. I probably could have. And there we go. Five minutes in, we're already done with one stage. Yay. <laughs> Life is like, oh yeah, hi, by the way. <laughs> we're gonna speed you along right to gate laboratory two. We got Ray Arrow. Oh, uh, looks like I got something. Got speed shot. All right. Let's go ahead and save. I got two E-Tanks, so I guess I don't need to go out of my way to get armor stuff, right? So I guess let's go ahead and go into... Let's use Falcon. Just for some variety. Is there any armor that you can get for zero in the in this game? I don't think so. Hello? Okay. Alright, I'm just gonna stand here for a second. Looks like... Black Zero is only available through a cheat code. Okay, whatever. Let's go Falcon Armor. Jump! I'm in armor, but I jumped in armor! Oh, this is the uh, Blade Armor. Cool. Does that still have the Jumping Slash? Yeah, it does. Hmm. Can I bust through this? Sorry, armor. Gotta leave you behind now. I don't need you anyways. It's fine. Okay, take this. Also, I have a saber. You know, considering Z Zero's uh, different saber style, I'm just assuming that X didn't give his saber back. Now this is mine. Forever. Aha! Zero's like, X, you can't even use it properly. See, you got yourself killed. Who needs the armor? Not me! Aha! Hey, look at this. Going through them much faster like this. This is where I abandoned it. Yeah, what's going now? Nothing. Nothing is what you're going to do now! Make it more fair. Where I can actually take damage. Yep, you just uh, stay crouched like that. That's where I died a minute ago. Crouch down again. Got him. That was very rude. He could have knocked me into that area to die. Let's see what we got down here. Okay, we're fine. Hmm. I wonder if that would go down lower if those uh, that those pillars weren't too high. Aha! Whoa! That was almost bad. Hey, 
Thanks. You're welcome. I, are we are we taking damage? Yeah, we are. I see. I saw the health. I saw the health. I was gonna say I, put, I went into normal mode. Get off me! Get dummy! Oh, they respawn. Of course they respawn. Come here. Don't you do it! Don't you do it! That jerk! You know what would have been funny? It's like, I thought about, uh, like, before we started X6, I thought about just saying, hey, you know what, since Inafune attend didn't intend X6, 7, and 8 to happen, what if we just skipped from X5 to zero one? one But no, 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 I wanted to... These games exist, and we, we should play. Climb back up. Climb back up, please. I don't want to go the alternate way. Way. I'm sure I can get back up to that ladder. What I'm really saying is, I don't want to go through. Um. I don't want to go through. I don't want to go. Th I don't want to go through this stage again. Looks like I'm gonna have to, though. Hold on. Ooh, ooh! I just need, I just need good timing. But what do I need to break that? Oh, I guess I don't need anything. Oh no! Okay. All right, um Now how how much of a mistake is that? Oh, okay, no, it's fine. I can just look down here to see if there's like a Hold on. Why won't let me cycle the other ones? Okay, Magnum Blade doesn't do anything. Aha! There is my solution. Once we get there again. All right, all right, all right, all right. So we'll keep the Z Saber out for now. We know how to break those blocks now, so we should be able to create a safe path there.
Okay. I mean, at the very least, all the stuff that's killing me. It's just instant death stuff. That's all it is. It's not me taking too much damage. Get there in a minute. Is that really the proper path? I mean, I guess it is. Break the black ones, but it can break the brown ones. Hey, come here, come here, come here and die. All right. Call BS on that. I was barely even touching that wall. And I can't really rush to this area because there's so many instant death traps in here. Blue box. Could really use a save state feature here. But you know what? It's fine. Get through it. Take this, boxes. Aha. Hoping that uh, Rock was just gonna hit the DNI guy and instantly kill him. That is not what happened. I think this is where I died last time. With all these annoying guys hanging out here. Would you, would you knock it off? Hold on, let me get back to that power. Okay. All right. Oh boy, man, what, what I would give for a safe state system. Whoa! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. This couldn't possibly be 
the proper path to the to the regular boss. Could it? That felt like a. Would you, would you knock it off? Bro, are you kidding me? Oh, never mind. We're right here. What was supposed to do here? Like, I know they respawn, but... Is there... Oh my goodness. There is... No, 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 no. This is op This is 100% an optional path. Right? It's gotta be, right? the flaming slash. No? Can't really get rid of any of that. So what do you think? I wonder if the ice thing can get rid of these. No? That's rude. Not quite far enough. So what do I do now? Am I stuck here? Well, we know if we, uh... No, not there. Not there. Also, we're gonna need to fight these guys real quick. Turn rookie hunter mode on. Hmm. I feel like we kind of soft locked in this stage. Like, not like we're not locked out of progression. We could always like get a game over and do the stage again or something. But what are we supposed to do here? Well, look for the uh, upgrade capsule stuff to see what it says about that. All right, so what what stage are we in? Metal Shark player stage? I Let's see, after getting past the second crusher, you'll find a ladder leading down. Instead, keep going left and find another crusher. Dash through as quickly as you can, and you'll drop into an area. Jump and use mock dash across to reach the capsule. Requires blade armor and ice burst. If you don't have ice burst, you can always use the speed, sir, or hyper dash chips. If using a cheat code, the ultimate armor will get it as well. Okay, I'm gonna look up a video real quick. So I wanna see how people get out of the stage. Unless there's like a... Uh...
Here we go. <laughs> Someone failing. Nope, and they just clip right next to the next uh, part that they were showing. Hmm. Here we go, Metal Shark player. Oh, I see. So if we can if we can get down there, if we can get over there. If we can get over there, there's a teleporter. Oh no, this is just bad level design. Yeah, 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 I started looking at looking at this. So we cannot make this jump. We're just stuck here and we have to get a game over. Well, this is unfortunate. <laughs> um. Because I don't think we can get this. I, I don't think we can do it with this with this armor set. So I think we just have to um, run through our lives and uh, yeah, get a game over. Sucks, but it is what it is. I could go back on a save file. Continue the game. No! Oh no! I'm sorry. Oh no. All right. We're gonna go back on our save file. So we don't have the blade armor, which means we cannot make that jump. And they just didn't program in a way to get out of it. We're still going as Falcon, though. <laughs> what a waste of time. What a waste of time. Getting semi-soft locked. Alright, let's go. I don't need the armor. Right, and all the reploids that you can rescue are still here because we went back on our save file. And yes, I saw that little icon for Ilya. She's probably gonna say, hey, did you know that the armor could crush you and kill you? I'm like, you know what? I hadn't even thought about it. I was just wondering if, uh, if saving those guys with the health, well, if that fills up my sub tanks, it looks like it, mm, I can't really tell. Anyways. At the very least, we're going through the stage again and we died in the same place we died the first time originally. Not intentionally, but we did. We'll wait. We'll wait for the next cycle. All right. And we're off again. Oh, come on! I was holding down! Ready? The animation hadn't started by the time it, it hit that point. But I was holding down on the controller. 
while in the in the middle of that dash. How are we doing on sub tank? Not very good. That's fine. All right, now we're gonna be careful right here. We're gonna be careful. Because if this crusher taps our head, we immediately explode. Right here. And here. And I'm gonna stop here and do it here too. Just to be careful. I can't go this way. I mean... Now I'm looking to see what the right where the where the correct path is even at. Cuz here's the other crusher thing. So we had a teleporter path by it first time, right? And the teleporter is usually an um, indication of uh, the alternate path to the optional boss fights, which we don't want to do. Oh, hey. Oh, right. <laughs> Freaky hunter mode. It's keeping me, it's keeping the crusher from instant kill. Wait a minute, hold on. Oh, what, 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 what? If it's keeping the crusher from instant killing me, why didn't it keep it from killing me in that one area earlier? That we were just in. Oh, jeez. I love this thing's inconsistencies. It's like they took X6's reputation and intentionally coded Rookie Hunter mode to not work correctly. Jeez. Do it! Don't you do it? No! I call shenanigans on that. So much shenanigans. Get out of here. Whatever. Let's go through here. Hopefully it's the right path. The only, the only path I... Okay. Oh boy, more crushers. Don't you love it? Do you knock it off? We're just gonna stay down here for a second. Of course, you know, you know the crusher. No, no, we're not gonna, we're not gonna kill you immediately for that. But this other stuff, sure. Like, watch this, watch this. Is this even gonna kill me? Oh, it's not even gonna hit. Me. Never mind. Get out of here. At least in Rookie Hunter mode, a single sword slash can kill that guy. Okay, our box is coming? No? Good. Oh, good. Instant death spikes! 
because why not? Yeah, I recall my, the, my, the last episode being so much more positive on uh, level design. Are you kidding me? Are we supposed to, like, jump from this? I guess. I guess we are. Okay. Whatever. So the vertical ones, I guess, where you have to crouch, I guess that's... A-okay for the one-hit KO, but the other ones are... No, no, the other ones are not. The other ones, uh, Brookie Hunter Mode can just magic you out of. Yeah, because that should have crushed me. But didn't. Just being very particular about it. At least it won't take me too long to get back to where we were in here. There we go. Where's the annoying one at? Hey, get over here! So I can shoot. Alright, we'll wait for it to go off. Ugh. I am not a fan of this platforming in this stage. Well, at least we're getting plenty of uh, health for our sub tanks with these retries. Ugh. Oh, wait. I slash you with my. Get, get, get out of the way! Get out of here. I'm sure there's another uh, weapon we can get. Actually, I don't know if there's another weapon we can get that can, de that can destroy those blue boxes, because we got all of the... I think we should have all of the weapons now, except for the, the one that's we get from this stage. Interesting. Unless something Zero has can attack that. Get out of here. Thanks for pander mode. <laughs> I appreciate the save there. Oh, jeez, this is terrible. What? What? <laughs> that scared me. with how it just popped out of nowhere. I'm like, what is happening? Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. This is just, this is annoying. Bro, are we, are we joking right now? I can't fight these things, so... Okay, you're getting the little boss animation explosion thing. All right, I wait the boss fight. Uh, can we go? Can we go in here and never come back? And never come back. All right, let's try the boss in regular mode. See how it goes. Ooh, he looks kind of cool. Kind of like his design. A little bit. <laughs> X, what are you up to? Instead of investigating the nightmare, you are manipulating it. It's strange that you're not affected by the nightmare. You have excellent DNA, don't... What is that supposed to mean? Okay. You must be Metal Shark Player. Metal Shark Player? What? Is that his name? Oh, it is his name. Okay.
his combat style is neat, where he's like swimming through the scrap metal. That's neat. Doesn't seem like he would be too bad to like learn the patterns before. Cause we're in normal mode and we're our, we're still doing decent. I mean, like I'm getting hit constantly, but I still got him. So yay me, I guess. I don't know. Man, that, that stage was frustrating. But we got through it. Got Metal Anchor, the new weapon. You got... Let's see, press attack plus down button while in the air. That's for zero, probably. Alright, we're talking about the boss. We don't care. Let's go ahead and... Save. I guess we have to go to the go to Gates Lab now since we got all we did all the other stages. Let's see if Zero can up anything. Saber extend. Can't use Saber extend. Let's see plus. There we go. What about X? X can equip one thing. Alright, well, we got. Weapon plus, okay. Now, people claim that it's impossible to beat this game with zero, I think, because of the platform. Let's go ahead and go in. We'll start with zero. Let's do it right? Interesting. I want to see what that Hunter Medal is for. Can I read them somewhere? Mega Man X Legacy Collection 2. Let's do it right. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So it's talking about how you can go to the lab early. Let's do it right is defeat all eight Mavericks before assaulting the laboratory. It's so like, uh, like in a normal Mega Man X game. Okay. All right, let's see. The secret laboratory of Gate exists in a place like this. Let's move in. Oh, look at that! We got a little extra animation there. Let's see what the new attack looks like. Okay. That must be Saber Extend. Maybe it extends the, um, the hitbox for that. Our radar condition seems to be very bad, and I can't get the clear vision. That's fine. We'll find the we'll find the lab. Oh, is it down? Okay, down we go. Ah, it's dark in here, but I can vaguely see something. Can you identify anything? Nope, lost the transmission. That's fine. Hello, that looks cool. Look at that. Look at that thing. That looks cool. Oh no. Yep. Ready? Plus that's it. Aha! I am saved from uh Oh my gosh. Alright. I can already see. Hey. Oh yeah, this I can already see how this would be. Very frustrating. Oh my gosh. Excuse me. Thank you! And I'm just gonna abuse this respawn mechanic. Come here, bat. Out of range, move back in range. Let's just do it one more time. 
Okay, maybe two more times. There we go. Okay, yeah, yeah, I can, uh... I can definitely see why people would not be a fan of this. But we'll see what, what Gate Lab 2 looks like. wonder how many stages there are. Let's do a walkthrough for Mega Man X6. We've got the... Eight stages. There are four Gates Lab stages. Wow. Jeez. Oh. These lasers aren't these yellow lasers aren't hurting. Okay, the, the initial blast at the end of the beam hurts me. Oh hey, I remember you! I remember you! From Mega Man X4. I'm not even mad that you're an annoying kick uh, enemy. I'm just happy because I recognize you. Is this the boss? Hmm? Okay. Um, okay? I'm confused now, but whatever. Okay. Now I understand. Why are we going down now? Okay, oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. The camera's moving so slow, I can't keep up with where I am. Oh, his saber changed color too. Wasn't it green before? This is a boss arena. All right, let's see what the first boss is. What you got for me? Is it Hymax again? What? Ugh. What is this? Is this... That dark cloud thing from... From the Kirby franchise? You know, like a little cloud that has the little lightning bolt that goes down? So I guess the name of the game is just uh, dodging until the eyeballs come out. All right. Oh, oh, of course you're doing a lot. Oh my gosh. How am I even supposed to keep up with that kind of speed? Oh, come on! That's a load of shenanigans, and you know it. Got him! 
All right, all right. I thought I was going to have to use a sub tank there for a second. All right, that's one. Can we do all of them? <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Oh, hello. What? We're already to gate? Okay. Evil must be defeated. I wanted to keep silence on this, but I will reveal the secret to you. Okay. I got something. It was a blessing. Guess what I got? I, fir I thought it was junk at first. It was a piece of Zero's body? Okay, so that does that have, like, the, um, the Zero virus in it from Mega Man X5? Okay, I obtained your DNA data. It couldn't be analyzed. I tried using the latest technology. What? You used my DNA? For what? Okay, so he made Hymax in the Nightmare from Zero's DNA. Okay. But it couldn't match the original. How dare you? <laughs> That's right. Delete the nightmare virus now. It's too dangerous. You're usually so calm. Don't worry. It's fine. And that yielded a virus from Zero's DNA. What I should do now is destroy this original body. What? Okay. Are we fighting gate now? No. Uh, okay. So do we have that? Okay. Did Zero come back from that? I'm confused. Let's go with Zero again, though. All right, this is the infamous, oh my gosh, it's so much BS stage that people always talk about. So let's see if it's as bad as people say. Could this possibly be another Mega Man X3? Where I get to one of the ending stages and I literally can't go through it? Well, let's find out. All right. I'm gonna shoot you. Anything up here? Ooh, there is something. What you got up here? Oh. Just a place you can go, I guess. Okay, how are our sub tanks doing? Pretty good. So, are there not any Reploids to save in these final stages? Hmm, I guess not. Ooh, hello. Hey, it's the totem thing from the, uh, from that earlier stage, the museum. That's cool. Zero didn't get to fight them. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have an idea. No. Oh, I can't walk on the floor. Ceiling. I was gonna say, if you could walk on the ceiling, that would be awesome.
Well, the state is certainly annoying so far. I don't see anything impossible about it yet, even though a couple of those uh, platforming things I just did were kind of, I think, just thanks to uh, Rookie Hunter. Because I was kind of standing on a spike on a couple of those platforms. But from what I understand, from what people said, there were, like, impossible jumps to make. It was, like, incredibly intricate... You need certain armor to make this jump sort of thing. Haven't seen anything like that yet. But we're not done yet. Got some spikes in this area. Kind of crouch down for this. Okay. Maybe this is it. Maybe? I don't know. Well, we're at the boss. I, I guess that was it. I suppose Rookie Hunter mode kind of fixes that problem if that's what people were talking about. Uh, Hymax just die. Okay. Are we going to have to fight you the same way as before? Looks like it. Whoa! Um, I guess I'll use this. There we go. Let's see if we get any more story stuff here. Yeah, Mega Man X6, Gate Lab 2, impossible jump without... Hold on, without parts equipped? Huh. Huh. I wonder if... Gate Lab 2 differences. Because I'm looking at Gate Lab 2. But the part that it was talking about, I don't remember seeing in, in the stage. Unless it's part of what we're going into right now. Because uh, I, I watched a YouTube video of it, and... The enemy in there I didn't recognize. Alright. Well, maybe we'll be learning new stuff here. It was a purple enemy that kind of looked like a, a castle garter. Or like a uh, not not Gussie Park. Um, what's it called? Uh, from Final Fantasy, Iron Giant. Iron Giant. That's what it was. Come <laughs> on. 
Oh, this thing right here. Okay, so maybe now we're in the section with the impossible jump. This is, uh, this is a little stressful, I guess. Nope, just, just stay there. Okay. Shame these guys don't drop health. That'd be a good place to refill my, uh, sub-tank. I'm gonna pull that video back up. Of the impossible jump. I wonder if I... I don't think I passed it there. No, I don't remember seeing that at all. Oh, we're fighting Gate? Awesome! All my reploids already have been destroyed. I confess that I have nothing to use. I couldn't analyze you enough. All right. Just give up and surrender. I won't. I'm so close. So close to what? Oh, that looks cool. Oh, interesting. Ooh, look at it. His helmet and everything looks very similar to Zero. So do I have to damage his orbs to damage him? Looks like it. Hmm, interesting. You know, if Sigma isn't in this game, I don't know if he is or not. This would be what I would refer to as the final boss. Like, it would be pretty... Just kind of getting that feeling from it, from how it's progressing right now. Now I get it. The orbs get destroyed, send out projectiles, and the projectiles can hit him. So he j is he just invincible outside of that? I guess. I guess that makes sense, because uh, if he made Hymax's armor... Yeah, if he, if he made Hymax, he would have known how to make the technology of his armor that would be invulnerable to uh, attack until uh, weakened by something. This boss fight's uh, rather annoying. I'm gonna be perfectly honest.
extremely annoying, if I'm being honest. Well, the Mega thing did some damage. What? What is happening? That didn't do anything. This is really annoying. Okay. What? What? Ready? Excuse me? <laughs> That's a load of crap. Um, huh. I wonder if Gate has a weakness. Not really. Yep, the only way to damage him is by attacking his orbs. It's kind of messed up, man. So what, this will be, what, what, unluck? Whoa! The frame rate just tanked! I guess slow and steady wins the race. Though a big problem here is, uh... The Z Saber can destroy the uh, projectile, so I have to make sure I'm not in a combo when I break these orbs. You want to actually do something? No, you don't? You want to just be annoying? Okay, there we go. Ooh, that was lucky. Okay. Slow and steady wins the race, right? Slow and steady wins the race. I was double checking to see if my, uh... My thing had been refilled. My sub tank. Oh my gosh! What is happening? It wasn't just lag, like, I couldn't do- I couldn't even, uh, use the attack input. That was annoying. I can't jump! 
I can't jump. Okay, okay, there we go. <laughs> I hit like I hit B like several times in a row, and I wasn't jumping at all. This is really annoying. Okay, there we go. We're getting a little more consistency now. Almost there. Oh my gosh. If there's something else past him that has a gimmick like this, I'm gonna be so upset. There! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, we got through it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Holy crap. Yeah, that's right. You're dead. No, I should have analyzed it more. Was there a fault in the program? This is not the end. Okay. What are you using? Oh. It's Sigma. Of course it is. Oh, hey, look, it's Sigma. Oh, please. I did not die. Nor did I need your help. Now get lost. Sigma, you seem to be having problems. Like, now it's it's just you. you ha ha. I'm waiting for you. You you're finished. I knew you'd return. So we meet again. Co Zero, you're the strongest robot. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I bet this scene is what people were talking about when they were guessing that uh that old guy looking robot was uh, an AI of Dr. Wily. Thinking that, um. Uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. I could, I could definitely see that. Do you want to cheese this and just say no? Just say, hey, guess what? Falcon armor literally can't die in. No, 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 no. We'll go into zero. Okay. Well, I guess we're just gonna keep going. We're just gonna keep going until it's over. Why are there spikes everywhere? Ah, the boss rush. Well, safe to say this is the last stage. Doesn't make sense, but whatever. Cause we're in, I don't know, maybe, I mean, maybe that second part of, I don't know. Ah, dragonfly lady. I liked you. Let's just uh, take care of you real quick. And you're gone. See ya. A little bit of an audio delay there. And here we go again. So, I can't wait to hear the story behind this, with Sigma coming back. 
Again. Oh, hey, I didn't, didn't we just fight you? There's two. Six to go. Audio delay again. Um, I don't... I'll, I'll have to check the footage when you guys uh, listen to this. But... I'm hearing the audio, like the sound effect of Zero warping back before the animation starts. Interesting. Ah, Phoenix guy. Like, I'm hearing all the other sound effects fine. You hear that magma stream or something like that i didn't notice that at all the first time we fought him well see ya there's number three we'll go get some more health yeah the delay happened again huh still filling it up oh yeah we're pretty much filled up now Let's get rid of this one, just so we can have... So it'll be a little bit easier to uh, jump up there without accidentally going into another fight. Hi, bud. Don't think you like that very much. Yep, I figured that was his weakness. I figured. I don't know. That audio delay just bothers me for some reason. Alright, sub tanks are full, so uh, we're just gonna go up there to heal now for now. Oh, uh, Metal Shark. Play Metal Shark Player. We can triple slash this guy. And there it goes again. And next. Oh yeah, this guy. Jump over him. And do a triple slash. Or two. Bye now. I'm sure a lot of people think. We were playing Rookie Hunter when that's cheating. I'm like, well, I mean, they did say Zero was the most powerful replicate, so technically, this could just be a power fantasy of Zero. 
being canonically powerful. All right, what else we got? Um, there's one. We should be getting close to the end of the boss rush now. What do you guys think about boss rushes? They are kind of a Mega Man staple, but at the same time, I don't know. Oh, this this guy's weird because I feels like I fought him a bunch of times because I technically I did fight him twice because I had to redo that one episode. From episode two. And there we go with the audio delay again. Not this one. Here we go. Here we go. This might be the last one before Sigma. I don't know. I feel like it would be cool. It does. We don't need to have a boss rush in here. Sometimes I f find them annoying. To just like pad out the time of. Oh yeah. Let me just spend the first half of this last level just fighting every boss again. But then again, this didn't take that long. Not really. Alright, now what? Where's the, uh... I guess there's a teleporter somewhere to take us to Sigma. Because, of course, Sigma's back again. Ah, here we go. It's a purple teleport. Let's see if we can get some uh, story bits on how Sigma got came back. Considering the DNA uh, reploids are everywhere, I'm assuming it has something to do with him. Maybe, like, uh, maybe these DNA things grab, like, the DNA of Reploids and, uh, enough to, like, uh, revive him or something. I don't know. Oh my gosh, this is great! That's great design! Because you could use that to grind and, uh, get all of your sub-tanks refilled in case you have to use them during the boss rush. That is fantastic. Oh, it's a uh, platform. All right, pardon me, guys. I'm gonna just walk waltz through here. I've got story I want to get to. Just watch there not be story at all. <laughs> watch there not even be story. And just be like, haha, I'm back. I'm going to kill you. Oh my gosh. Are you okay? Are you good over there? Cough, is it X or zero? Okay, so Sigma, like, is Sigma, like, on his deathbed? Who cares? Just leave. I'll still be able to destroy you. Okay. What is happening? Okay, I kind of want to pad this out and see, like... Huh. Oh, he sounds like a zombie. How does he... How would he even come back from this in Mega Man X7? Where are you? Kid, I'll show you what terror is all about. 
die. <laughs> His mind is gone. Okay. Alright, well, let's see what his next form looks like. Big robot thing? Ooh. Okay. Whoa! Alright, this is... this is... I will admit, this is pretty cool. Like, aesthetically, this looks pretty great. Oh, they drop lives and they drop health? Is this it? Surely not. You can't defeat me so easily, you know you can't zero. I'll come back to fight you again. I will, I will. Oh, I guess that's it. Really? All right, I'm gonna look up a video of X doing it. Nope, same boss, okay. I was wondering if it was different with X. It'll take a while to get rid of this. Even with the latest technology, it's hard to succeed. I'm not really sure if I can fix this completely. Don't worry. But you haven't had any problems yet. You'll be fine as you are, won't you? What will we do in a crisis without you? But I'm scared that I may become a disturbing presence. Okay, so Zero is like sealing himself away. Oh, it will be about August 5th, 102 years from now. Okay. Yeah, because the Mega Man Zero... Okay, so the Mega Man Zero series takes place 100 years after the events of the Mega Man X series. So... Okay, okay, okay. I'll give them credit for that. That could realistically connect to Mega Man Zero One. It could. Zero gets sealed away. 100 years later, he, get, he awakens and the Zero series happens. Okay, all right, I, okay. You know what, that makes sense because in Mega, okay, 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 yeah. That does, okay. That does make a little more sense than Mega Man X5 to Zero One because in uh, Mega Man Zero One, Zero has his whole body and you just wake him up. In a Mega Man X5, his body was destroyed. So this would make sense, puts himself to sleep in Mega Man X6 even though it completely, it's completely retconned with uh, uh, the backstory of Mega Man Zero 3 and 2. This is confusing. This is confusing. We'll be able to talk about this in the future. Um. So yeah, I could see this connecting. I... So now that we've seen all of it, I did play in the Rookie Hunter mode a lot. I can definitely see why people hate this game. Because mechanics wise, it's great. But I can see a lot of the level design being atrocious. So I can understand why people hate it. I enjoyed it for the most part. There were some frustrating bits, but I enjoyed it for the most part.
then again, as soon as we hit Mega Man X7, it's probably going to get even more confusing. So, plot. Following the Eurasia and Nightmare incidents, which are the uh, X5 and X6, Reploids work diligently to rebuild the Earth. X decides to retire in search of more peaceful solutions, leaving Zero in charge, and that doesn't make sense, because if Zero is sealed away, he wouldn't be around to be in charge. Okay. I guess that's just... Hey! More games. All right, well, there's the end of the credits, I think. Oh, hey, here we go. One hour, 45 minutes. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. We went almost that long today. Oh, here and here is like it's unlocking the secret commands for us. This is basically to unlock the ultimate armor and the black armor zero. All right, we're done. That was uh, Mega Man X6. Next week, I guess we'll uh, jump into Mega Man X7. And we'll see how the uh, ongoing list of uh, retcons for this series go. But yeah, I'll see you. Uh, yeah, I'll see you next week. And if you've been watching my Final Fantasy VII Remake Let's Play, I'll see you maybe in a couple days.